Tobago has been experiencing some extremely hot weather recently, with a few spells of rainfall in between. However, the hurricane and rainy seasons are upon us. Meteorologist Carolyn Dakoto from the Meteorological Services Division, Tobago, provided details of how the hurricane and rainy seasons could affect Tobago in the coming months. At a media conference hosted by Chief Secretary Fale Augustine, meteorologist Carolyn Decoto said the hurricane season is expected to have a 58% chance of above normal activity and a 32% chance of it being normal. However, she said there will likely be more rainfall activity than what occurred last year. We expect to have more storms than we had over the last year, um, the last, but over the last 20 years or so. Right, we expect about four named storms and likely hurricanes, about three number of uh, hurricanes, about one to four hurricanes. De Koto noted that this does not mean all of these things will affect the island, explaining that they will be to the east of Tobago. However, if they start moving into the island's area of interest, anything forming in that area will affect us. Moreover, Dakota highlighted that it may not always rain during the rainy season. She noted that during last year's rainy season, there were hot spells, which she said the World Meteorological Organization defines as five consecutive days with temperatures exceeding 35 degrees Celsius. We also have uh, heat spells as such, so that may be about uh, three days or so. So this um, activity we expect to have that affecting us later in the year around September more August to September those are the months that we will have heat spells and that also coincides with the peak of the hurricane season she said that the peak of the hurricane season occurs in the middle of September the quota then spoke about the areas that will be affected by this activity such as Crumb Point due to its urbanization what we expect this year wetter than usual uh, conditions for Tobago. That is good news for Wasa. Um, there's a chance that the western areas of Tobago, I don't know, I don't think you'll have any catchment areas in that area, but um, that doesn't mean that the activity will be exclusive to southwestern Tobago. She pointed out that the blue areas on the diagram have a chance of above normal activity. In the first half of the rainy season, from June to August, conditions are expected to be normal to above normal, which is wetter than usual for Tobago. She noted that this would be good news for Wasa. Ariana Scipio, Tobago Updates Television News.